Thanksgiving is coming up next week, which means we will soon be watching that Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. The Jonathan Marching Band was invited to perform, and Teresa Weekly will be along for the ride. She has a look now at what it takes to send 300 kids to New York for the week. It's a lot of planning, and for one family, preparing for this trip has been a challenge times three. Every step around this track at Jenison High School takes the band closer and closer to New York City. Not that many people, they can say, I marched in the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. This is one of six high school bands that will perform in the parade on Thanksgiving Day. It will cost roughly $350,000 to send 300 kids to New York City for the week. After fundraising, that breaks down to about $1,600 per student. The kids have spent more than 100 hours in rehearsal and will spend 14 hours on a bus to get there, then march two and a half miles down the streets of New York, all for a one-minute, 15-second performance, which they'll remember for a lifetime. Three minutes. One minute. One minute. <laughs> Three, four minutes. The Milnamau family is used to crunching numbers. Camden, Laney, and Joey are triplets. They're all in the marching band. It's really nice to have someone doing the same things as you at the same time, because if there's something you don't really understand, I have two people that are doing the same thing, and one of them's probably going to understand it. The Milnamau kids have been in band since they were in sixth grade. The boys are both on percussion, while Laney plays the clarinet. It goes really fast, but like it's a lot of fun, and you kind of get closer with the people in your section, which I think is pretty cool. They've been preparing for this trip for a year and a half when Macy's announced the invitation. First, we were just like super excited. I mean, what a great opportunity. We can't, I mean, it's amazing. And then it started to sink in, like this is gonna cost a lot of money. Donations from family and friends are helping the family cover that cost for what will be an unforgettable experience. We all kind of understood that this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. For now, they're enjoying every step in the process until it's their moment to shine. Jenison just won state finals earlier this month and would normally be preparing for nationals right now, but they're all really excited to replace that with this incredible experience. You can follow along on the trip with me all next week, including on my live blog at woodtv.com. In the studio, Teresa Weekly, News 8.